Hello everyone, welcome to episode 6 of my series, 7 Days to Die, Alpha 15, Dead is Dead. Um, like most nights, I got quite a bit done. Um, I was actually out mining and cutting down trees, as you can see it's getting really clear around my base. I'm probably going to replant the trees after day 7, that way the horde don't tip them over and ruin my... Uh, little tree farm I plan on making. I also got a bunch of clay and a bunch of stone, so I decided to make a forge after all. I don't think I'm going to use it until tomorrow though, that way the zombies are already be coming anyway, so I might as well just wait till like day 7, around the night time probably. Um, I got spikes set up all around. My pillars reinforced them. Today, I plan on going over there where that flag is, kind of like over here. Because I saw those houses earlier, I kind of want to see. And just to show. Oh, wrong one. Still not died. I spent all my skill points on survival, uh, run forest, run camel, and I think it was quality Joe. So I can start finding some better items when I'm looting. But besides that, it was another super quiet night at my little fort. So. Getting lots of stuff done at night. It's really nice. Normally I, I get hit by random hordes all the time. I'm not sure if they toned it down or made it so they come more after night 7. Either way, it's really nice. Someone told me I should start working on a farm, and then I found out they got rid of stone hose. I don't know why. I mean, I guess it's not too hard to get the metal one, but you need a forge to make that, so. And now it's gonna rain again. This is how it gets when it rains now, apparently. It's kind of a super dense fog. Hopefully, it doesn't stay like this for too long. It's almost more like smoke rolling in from like the burnt biome if you ask me. It doesn't really seem like rain. No, oh, I started going the wrong way. Sorry. I just started picking stuff up and got lost. Need all the ammo I can get. Hopefully, I don't get bit in the ass by a dog again. That was fun. Not really, but... Definitely woke me up a little bit. Hopefully you guys are liking these new videos with the slightly better quality and the longer run times. I think it's going to make it a lot better. You couldn't get anything done in 20 minutes before. I felt like I was rushing the whole time and then I'd look down and only have like 2 minutes left and I didn't get anywhere. So, I'm going to try to go for like 30-ish minutes from now on. As long as I don't get any uh, frame rate drops that are too bad. I keep getting a little bit, but it's not horrible. As long as you guys can handle it, I'll just keep recording through it. Oh, wow, it's right. Look, a little farmer zombie. Or is that a construction worker? Oh, that's an old man. Oh, wow. 
wow, that old guy got back up. I thought he was dead. Oh, I shot him by accident. Wow, these guys can take a beating. Well, finally made a club. Oh, that was a bad idea. Jeez, it, he doesn't even care. He's like, whatever, man. That shit don't face me. Oh, you getting angry. Did you forget to eat your oatmeal today, old man? What the hell is that zombie doing? Is it trying to take the bridge out? Showing so much challenges, huh? Kill you first, then. Oh. oh my god. Finally, I swear I've shot like 20 arrows at that guy. There you go, honey knight. What about you? Guessing the old man would carry some like farming equipment or maybe uh some casino tokens. That zombie was all over me a second ago and it just now it's just going that way. Stay out of sight, maybe it'll leave me alone. I also uh, turned down my game volume just a little bit so you guys should be able to hear me over the game a little bit better. I didn't realize how bad it was at some points. The zombies can get really loud. It's that zombie... I almost want to go put it out of its misery, but... What's my luck? Let's draw some more if I go over there and mess with that one. Red stuff. Garbage. Oh, I love this flashlight. Just for now. I really hope I can pick those back up. Come on, maybe some medicine? Yay. I have not found antibiotics yet. Ooh. A turd. No, I mean, ooh, a gun. Clearly. I don't know why you can't scrap cowboy boots. Hmm. I should have dropped that clay. Back at home. I'm just gonna drop that too. fridge. I thought it was the growl of a dog. I just stopped dead in my tracks. It looks like they're growing something in the backyard. I wonder what that is. If that's hops, I will be so happy. I'm not really sure where you find hops yet. Well, there's a ladder upstairs. Okay, bear with me. I'm going to break down the door. This one's not reinforced though, so it's pretty easy to get through. Oh, 
I wanted to drop it first. Suitcase and a bookcase. In the back. No books. I wish my attic was this empty. I don't know about you guys, but I got all kinds of stuff up in my attic, like holiday stuff. And stuff from family members who just moved out like 20 years ago and just left all their crap. Be cool if they had more items. Christmas lights would be a pretty cool uh, addition to the game. Maybe they'll add it once they get uh, the electricity in. Enjoy some holiday spirit while you're slaying some zombies. Oh, a shotgun schematic. I like how it's in the dresser and not in the bookcase. Uh, can I can't scrap it. I'm not gonna wear that. It's too hot here. I was reading the forms last night. It seems like a lot of people are having trouble with overheating, but I haven't had any bugs at all really besides that one frame bug and just a little bit of a uh, frame rate drop now and then but that only seems to happen when I get really close to mountains or like right now I just spawned all these zombies in this house so that's why we dropped frames a second ago but for the most part I think this is one of the most stable releases for experimental they've probably ever done I'm sure multiplayer is having bugs though. Give me your medicine. Ah. There we go. 99. I would make a joke about bed bugs biting, but bed bugs are not a joke. <laughs> Anyone who's ever had them knows that. Zombie in here. Hello. I heard you knocking. Oh, there he is. Might be two in here. Oh, twitchy. But you can't do it again. Oh shit. Where is that zombie? Must be in this room. As long as it's not trying to eat me, we can live, I guess. Another mining helmet. Oh! Crap. I think I'm going to work on an exit plan really quick and not go back out that way. Drop this. Shit. I think it went around to the front. Yep. Sorry, buddy. There's at least like two or three outside right now. Smart enough to focus on hitting one spot. Maybe they'd be in here by now. Not that I'm complaining. <laughs> oh wow, what the hell? Two guns in the toilet? <laughs> awesome. I didn't mean to shoot. No! Oh 
no hugs of death. How did you even... Oh, the back door, you cheeky little fucker. Okay, avoided getting tagged. Uh, there's still a little bit of loot in here I want to get. Yeah, I'd be angry too. Come here. Got some for you too. Kitty pal. Parts cool. Now I just need two more, I think, and I can get the spotlight. I'm not gonna get stuck in this house. I heard you coming. I'm just gonna. I think I finally got them all. I want to go up in this attic. And then after that, I think we're just gonna leave this little house. Go check out that farm behind the other one. If I have time, we'll get the third house. Hmm. Uh, I don't want to scrap the guns, because I know they at least got some bullets in them. What do I need? Oh, is this? Okay. This attic looks empty, so for a backpack. myself value oh I thought it was over there stupid hat oh something for another schematic have goggles on. Yeah. Put some sunglasses on. I think ooh. Uh, an iron pickaxe. I think I'm gonna go this way really quick. Follow this road west and then I'll come back and check out the farm. Actually. Oh, crack a book. Yes, I need to go this way. I thought that was over here. I wasn't sure. I don't know if I'm going to have time to get home tonight. Let's just avoid all these stupid zombies. Now I can use this.
Okay, well, let me pick those up. Yucca seed. Oh, pretty far from the desert. Don't care. Bullet tips. Uh, if it wasn't so many of them, I'd just drop them. But. to pick up a few books if I need to just pick up books and leave fertilizer in a bookstore that seems kind of strange but I guess I don't really have a gardening store yet I wonder if there's any zombies in here at a bookstore, because the only time you want to read is when you're getting hammered. Uh, one second guys, I have to meet my microphone, my fiance is calling me. So just give me one second. Okay guys, I'm back. Sorry, I was out for a little bit. My fiance's on her way home from work and picking up some groceries for me. So... Well, <laughs> I'm glad I checked out the bookstore. I know the good schematics, but at least now I know where it is for future reference. Um, God, I can't see... This is how it was that uh, 
day three or day four when I said it was like this all morning. This is why I didn't record. I can't see shit. Now I can with the flashlight, but I didn't have this before. So I'm lucky I haven't walked into a bear. I'm surprised I haven't actually. I'm out of trees by my house, so just want to stop first. Oh yeah, I need to keep moving. It'd be nice if the zombies moved when they saw you, not when they're about to hit you. I don't know if you guys have ever read the book uh, World War Z. Not the movie. The movie. I hated the movie. If you guys have ever read the book, you'll probably agree with me. But in the book. If a zombie moaned, and another zombie a mile away heard it, it would also moan, and it would continue on and on for miles. So if one zombie saw you, you could not stay where you were, because in a few weeks you'd have hundreds of thousands of zombies just coming towards you, because they know there's food over there. And it's as scary as it sounds. I definitely think you guys should read that book if you haven't. Well, oh. yet another day, and make it back to my base alive. Happy days. Well, I'm not sure when I'm going to start recording. My fiance is going to be home soon. I don't want her to walk in while I'm recording, so I'm probably going to stop the recording right about now, and then pick up around 8 o'clock on day 7, that way uh, we can see all of the, or night 7's horde. Uh, thanks a lot for watching guys, like, subscribe, comment, let me know how I'm doing, I think I'm getting a little bit better at making videos, so hopefully you guys agree. Uh, stay safe out there survivors, it's a harsh world man.